What is up, fellow YouTube goers? We are here chilling in the studio, in the setup. I don't know why there's a Sharpie here. That's kind of random, but you know what? This video is so chill right now that All right, in today's super chill video, as you can see, there's just so many vibes going on right now. So just insanely chill. Um, today, I'm gonna be doing a kind of Kendama comparison, I would say. Um, let me find them actually here. So I'm gonna be comparing two Kendamas, one from 2016, I believe, one from 2019. Let's do it. Let's just look at the differences. Where is this? There's one, and there's two. All right, so as you can see in this video, we're gonna be comparing a Kendama, both from analog. We're gonna be comparing the evolution of analog pretty much from 2016. And then we got, of course, the Dave Chur pre-mod, or not pre-mod, bro, I'm actually stupid. Um, the Dave Chur Pro Mod, my very own Pro Mod here, it's gonna be dropping, should be dropping tomorrow, the day that I'm filming this, so go cop one tomorrow so yeah i'm just gonna be going over these two kanamas kind of show the differences that three years has um so let's actually start with the zona here so like i said from 2016 this thing is super honed super beat up as you can see side by side actually the pro mod is actually way bigger so obviously the shape has gotten bigger over the years that's pretty much the same with every single kanama the cups have gotten bigger Overall, it's just gotten bigger. You can even see with like the cup sizes, the big cup is substantially larger. Substantially? Is that a word? No. Uh, small cup, way bigger. Base cup, obviously it's got the lunar balance hole and it's way bigger as well. Um, in terms of the overall shape between these two, let's take this tom off this one. This one is a beach can. This is a maple. That doesn't really matter that much. But... The spike length on this one, is the cups are really pushed down on this one, so you can kind of notice that. Obviously, the, the spike's flat with this one, that just comes over playing it over time. Having the cups actually being bigger makes them much more defined and much easier for gunslingers as well. So that's one thing that Analog has kind of improved over the years, is just the shape of the cups overall. You can really see with this one, the old one, it's really not that defined. And then with the newer squab shape, the cups are much more defined, uh, much steeper edges, steeper curves. That's kind of the theme with kendamas these days. In terms of the handle stall, ring stall, the handle stall obviously is bigger. The ring stall is more defined. It's bigger, so it's going to be easier for those ring stall and handle stall tricks. And the shape is just really different. Like seeing the transformation of these two, this is so much bigger. The cups are so big compared to the to the 2016 OG Zona, it's actually insane how far the shape has come. And this kind of goes with all Kendamas as well. Um, pretty much every Kendama over the year has developed like, like an insane amount. I don't know why it took me forever to think of that, but like even with Sweets Kendamas, pretty much every Kendama company, you can see the development over the years and the change in the shape. Um, in terms of the Tama, I don't really see that much of a difference. It should be the same size, yeah bevel is pretty much the same the bevel on these old ones turn off my ringer there but the bevel actually on the old one is was pretty big back in the day in 2016 so they're pretty much the same um, both satin paint super sick but obviously you guys can see the biggest difference is these cups yeah that's pretty much a comparison from 2016 shout out og analogs they're still super sick like you can still do tricks on these and stuff obviously but the cups are way smaller um, it's just gonna be a lot harder. I'm not, I don't know why I'm talking about this, like you guys can buy this. I'm just doing a little comparison. Um, like I said in the beginning, make sure to go cop a Dave Chur Pro Mod. It's gonna be dropping tomorrow. I'm not sure exactly what time yet, so just stay tuned for a, an exact time. But that's pretty much it. Hopefully you guys like this comparison style of video. I did this with the $15 versus the $130 Kanama. 
Um, so this is like a three-year-old Kanama versus current day. So yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Hopefully you guys liked it. If you did, make sure to leave a like, make sure to subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace. I gotta go to the bathroom again. Hunt it back, hunt it back, get it right back. Switch it up, flip it up, bet you like that. Go put your number on this paper, cuz I would love to take you up on a lovely day. Don't care what your last situation. Uh.